Anna Danchev ja olen Balkan Most Festivaaleilla yhtyeni Danchev Domain kanssa. Well, first of all, it's my name, Danchev. And then Domain uh, comes from the fact that ever since I was a child, I've been singing uh, traditional music and that's public domain. Yeah, so now when I started uh, my own band with my own compositions, my own stories, I really wanted to emphasize that I'm not updating any tradition or no, I'm not trying to recreate something that has been already. So this is my domain, it's Danchev domain. <laughs> Open up your eyes, you'll see the sun will shine up in the sky. kind of cliche but uh, I was born to family with music so I started to do music or be with music ever since I was born. Um, my father is a Bulgarian musician and he moved to Finland in 1960s and he brought his tradition with him and uh, because of him I have been growing up with not only Bulgarian musical tradition, but also, I mean, music in general, I've been growing up in my in my family. So uh, I can't really say when I started, but with this band Danchev Domain, uh, we have started uh, 2019. But uh, I've been doing music for my profession uh, already a couple of decades, like, Well, first of all, Bulgarian singing, and then Finnish traditional music, and Afro-American music, and, you know, cover bands, and jazz, and stuff like that, so, yeah. I'm a mountain girl, and I say the sea, with my two hook, it's a very long. I'm a mountain girl And I sail the seas From a flat country I took up to the world to see I'm a mountain girl And I sail the seas With my two hook It's a very long history I'm a mountain girl And I sail the seas From a flat country I took up to the world to see Never, never give myself away trombone I love the sound of trombone and the character of trombone is so strong and sensitive at the same time and the sound of trombone it suits my voice very well and uh, when I started the band when I started to vision my my uh, idea about my own sound 
So uh, the first thing what I was thinking was trombone, that I want to have trombone in my band to do both bass lines and to be like the second voice to me. And uh, then obviously I had to find the right musician, <laughs> also like right character uh, to be with me on the stage so that we, you know, we have a dialogue and we, we are balanced and yeah. I'm a songwriter, and every songwriter, we take inspiration from life, our personal life and the life that is surrounding us. So, so obviously, Definitely what I know. have experienced myself, what I have thought myself or seen or heard myself, so everything that uh, also affects on my music. So, in a way, uh, all these bicultural identity issues and being a really small minority group in Finland... <laughs> In a way, it is part of my music as well. But I don't write my songs uh, in a way that I try to, you know, explain something. Because music is emotions, at least to me, it is emotions. And then emotion is, is the fact that makes me, you know, do the song or compose the lyrics. The lions we are, the guardians of our Don't give up, don't hide We have to live, that's what we are here for Myself. Yeah, my father is Bulgarian and my mother is Finnish. I grew up with Bulgarian tradition in Finland, so it was in our home, even though it's, it wasn't like outside of the home. I have a strong connection to Bulgaria and uh, when my grandparents, for example, they were still alive, I used to travel and, and you know, visit them a lot and then we had uh, contact by phone and letters and stuff like that. So there has always been a very strong connection to Bulgaria even though I am mainly located in Finland. My father didn't come to Finland uh, in 1960s because of any Bulgarian community. He, he came because of music. He was a musician, you know, 
uh, having gigs in Europe and then he came to Finland with his Bulgarian band and you know he stayed in some places it's more connected and more tied together but for example I was born in northern part of Finland in a very small village called Haapavesi and uh, we didn't have other Bulgarians living nearby so there was no actually Bulgarian community to, to connect with. There are love songs, there are hate songs, there are, you know, angry songs and really funny and happy songs and, sh- and silly songs. And yeah, because for me, life is like that. I mean, it goes ups and downs and, and uh, you never know what is like behind the corner, basically. I plan to continue, obviously, with my band Dunch of Domain. We have uh, released two albums already and now we start working for the third one. And it means that we start all over again. It's like always like then when you do the creative process that even though you have done things, when you start new creative process, you start from the scratch. So it will take some time. And uh, maybe in 25, if I'm, if I'm lucky, my third album with Dunch of Domain will be released. Thank you so much, Kesönöm. We are Dunch of Domain and we say kiitos.